this training program basically intend to give an awareness for the customers and technician how to install high console water heaters so let us understand how the product is supplied the solar water heaters are supplied in three different boxes let us see the boxes first you can have one tank packed with solar water tank, water heater tank and another box with evaporated glass tube and the third box with stand pots so we have three boxes one box is having solar tank the other box having evaporated glass tube and another box having stand pots so let us see the uh, what are the things uh, contained in uh, one solar stand stand pots box okay. so you can see Tape stock. Then uh, these are end supports for glass tube and this uh, dust seal. And you can see uh, leg parts also. You can see leg leg support. This also known as feet. And you can see uh, these are C frames where the tank got support. And we have one uh, cover full of nuts and bolts. Fasteners used for fixing the tanks, stand boards, and we have leg. We have total uh, stand board assembly. So these are the things contained in a stand board box. So for the assembly of one solar water heater, we only require two small tools. One is ring spanner, size twelve. 13 and another one is a double end spanner it is 10 and 11 the small basic tool required for the assembling of solar water the first process is to fix the c frame on this leg so we have c frame we have to fix the c frame on this uh, leg so this is the direction so help me like this standard uh, like this short so we have to fix this angle bar short here like this this angle bar support long we have to fix this angle bar support short long Now we have, we have the frame fixed. Now we have to fix the uh, two feet. One at the front side of the system. So one is for right side and another one is left side. So we have to keep these uh, frames. Uh, two crossbars. Okay. So we are going to fix this crossbars. Uh, the tail stock. So tail stock will be fixed here, like this. We have two bars, which is fixed here. This is for fixing the reflectors. So, like this. We have two bars. The last thing to be fixed on a solar water frame is the reflector. This is for basically for reflecting the sun rays under the tubes. Before fixing the frame on the terrace, we have to identify the south. Now the south has been marked and the solar water heater should be faced towards south direction. Before fixing the tank on the frames, you can see a slot here. This slot should be merged on the C frame here. So now we will rotate the tank. Now it is rotated and we are merging the screw. Yes, yes. It is clearly merged on the C frame. Now 
with the nut it is tightened to the safe frame now the tank is fixed on the frame now see this is the end cup we have to fix this end cup on this tail stock we have a hole here we have to fix the end cup like this we have to fix it like this last step of fixing a soda water heater is fixing the glass tubes now let us open the glass tube box see this is what evacuated glass tube is about you can see uh, it is very well packed we have thermocol fixed at both ends like this before inserting the glass tube we have to fix this dust steel on the tubes so before that we have to lubricate the dust steel and we have to lubricate uh, we have to lubricate the tube tube also then uh, this dust steel shall be inserted like this the same way we have lubricate the tube we have to lubricate the silicone rings this is silicone rings inside the uh, we are going to insert the glass tube into the tank so see we have to first we have to insert the glass tube into the tank then we should rotate the tank by pushing it inside the rotation should be in clockwise okay it is now it is the tube is getting rotated and it is inserted in the tank now we have to bring back the tube see now here you can see once again we just repeat it just repeat it okay so it is going inside to the end dish now the tubes are rotated clockwise into the tank then now it is taking back to the end cup by rotating to anti clockwise after fixing the glass tube you have to push the dust steel to the tank like this like this